Galveston County Fair and Rodeo for the second weekend. Now, this weekend we decided to kind of get the behind the scenes look at things. And with us tonight is... Ron Wolford. And he is with, what's the name of your team? The other cookers are always in heat. And they are a lot of fun, trust me. Okay, so now tell us, how do you prepare for feeding so many people, the general public? For a party this large, we have to start several weeks in advance. We divide the, the task up many, many people in the team. We have two head cooks, and then we come out and get a lot of food together and pre-cook two weeks ahead of time and we cook like 40 briskets and 75 racks of ribs. We pan them out, we freeze them, then we bring them back and warm them back up to feed the general public. Okay, so now we're talking competition because I see these guys all getting ready for competition. Where are we at on all of this? Uh, right now we just finished turning our uh, chicken and the chicken wings were earlier today. And we got some cuts on both of those. So now we're getting ready for tomorrow to cook overnight our brisket and our ribs to turn in tomorrow. So that's what we're doing right now is, is brisket, uh, getting the briskets ready to, to turn in. Okay, so how'd you do the competitions uh, for today? So far they haven't got the total competitions yet, but we made what they call second cut. And we've got several second cuts in categories, so we're doing pretty good. Earlier today somebody told me this is organized chaos. Exactly. And you've got a big party going out on the other side of this tent? Oh yeah, we're the biggest party out here, so come out with us next year and we'll party even more. We will. All right. Thank you very Thank much, you. Ron. Thank you. Appreciate it. We've got Dan Arnold here who is a bull rider for, what, over 20 years? Yes, ma'am. 21 years. Oh, my goodness. So where are you from? Santa Fe, Texas. Right here in Santa Fe. Right here in Santa Fe. So what the hell do you think you're doing? <laughs> well, just trying to stay young, I guess. <laughs> doing what I've been doing my whole life. So what got you started bull riding? Shoot, I just the desire to do something different. Uh, probably more than anything, my family thought said I couldn't do it because I was too big, so mm -hmm. I set out to prove them wrong mostly. So what what are you feeling and what are you thinking when you're on a bull? Oh, hang on. Stick, hang on. Keep huh? your head down and hang on. Don't quit till your head hits the ground. So if somebody's out there looking to be a bull rider, what would you suggest? Try roping. A okay. lot safer. I'm Would glad you? my kids don't ride bulls, and I'm glad of it. Well, are you going to ride tomorrow night? I am. Tomorrow at 4 o'clock. Okay. End of story. Thank you, Dan. You're <laughs> All right, here we are. Friday night, second weekend of the Dallas County Fair Rodeo. County rodeo. Fair rodeo. <laughs> Had a lot of fun. We have. We visited with the live bunch and the other cookers, yep. and we are having a great time. And right now, we've been to the rodeo, we've been to the barbecue, yep. and now it's Wayne Toops. Y'all enjoy. Make it fast,